What's up guys, this is Brad from Impact Props, and I want to show you, uh, this is the original of the Tar Heels dagger that I made here, and we got the mold right here, and I just poured a cast, so I guess I want to show you guys what it looks like when you're demolding uh, your first cast. This is the first one ever, so you guys are lucky. You can come closer. You want to show this? So I uh, tighten everything with duct tape here, and I had to make it tighter because I poured uh, I didn't pour enough resin in there, so I had to clamp everything tighter. And I don't know if that'll that's a good thing or a bad thing. But it's all trial and error on the first cast because you don't know exactly how much resin to use. So sorry, this is kind of tedious. Probably just cut that, didn't you? Probably, but I'll just make it fast. And this last one. I like to start on the ends, so if you guys don't start in the middle, because then you won't get get it all get it centered. As you can see, this is the very first cast. It's exciting. It's very exciting for me. Wow. Okay. So, I'm very happy with this. As you can see there, there's no flashing on the sides here, except for the front. I don't know why it's like that in the front, but none along the sides. So that means my, my seam, I did a good job with the clay. Patching everything up. And there we go guys, as you can see, there the seam line is right there and there's a little bubble there. And that is my bad, <laughs> it's trial and error a little bit. Um, but there's no bubbles on feeling the structure here. Solid seam line that goes already down, all the way down, that's very easy to take care of. And especially down the middle here and on the wood. And then I got the pour spout. So now I have two, and they're completely identical, and I'm super happy with this mold. So, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll talk to y'all later.